new artist is making huge waves in the rock and roll art scene recently. And Baruch had a chance to get to uh, behind the creative process of this artist who can be seen every day right here on Fox at 5 at 10 p.m. news. This That's exactly right. Hard. So it's we always know fun. Him. Oh, yes, Steve Lacey. It's always yes. fun when you learn about the extracurriculars of your co yeah. right? What do I do <laughs> after hours? Sometimes you don't want to know. But in this right. case, I did. And I got to do just that with Steve Lacey. Check it out. Well, this generation of high school students is certainly social media savvy. You know him as the co-anchor of the Fox 5 News at 5 and 10. Drum roll it, put down the screens, do my thing. But did you know that Steve Lacey is also an artist? This is what I do when I'm not at work, anchoring the news, this exercise, the other side of my brain. Um, this is where I make large-scale screen prints on canvas. For Steve, art has always been the driving force. As an only child, I always was into drawing, art, keeping myself busy. So that's been a lifelong passion. Three years ago, I got heavily into screen printing, learning the whole thing, and Photoshop too, so you can create the images that you then print on the canvas. After perfecting his craft, Steve teamed up with rock photographer Mark Weiss, manipulating Weiss's photos of rock legends and adding his own whimsical touches, like this portrait of Slash, where he replaced the guitar with a fish. I realized that you know all the images I grew up on as a kid in rock magazines in the 1980s were taken by him. And as his artist transitioned beyond a pure hobby, Steve has toured his work around the country, attracting the attention of bold-faced names, including supermodel Adriana Lima. We're up right now in Miami, which is so exciting. We're at, a, at this really cool gallery called Walt Grace Finches. They sell sports cars, guitars, and they have our art on the wall. People are interested to find out I'm a news anchor because that's not, I don't lead with that. Like I'm not like, I'm a news anchor and I do art. It's like, you know, I, I do this completely independently. So it becomes like an interesting story when they find out, oh, so I don't get it. Like, you do this and you do the news, and it's like, yeah. <laughs> That's exactly it. And the fulfillment extends beyond the bottom line, complementing Steve's work on television. When you're in a local environment, you know, you could be talking about politics, local, sports, weather, it's do -do 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 everything. This forces you to slow your brain down and just focus on getting the ink through the screen. So it's meditative for you. Absolutely. And as he continues to produce these creative tributes to rock's biggest stars, the experience will come full circle once the canvas's subjects enjoy the fruits of Steve's labor. I hope they like it. I hope Slash likes seeing himself with a fish. Wouldn't that be crazy? I hope he gets that it's meant in, you know, as the ultimate tribute and a sign of how much I love him. It's like, oh my God, I'm so obsessed with you, to the point where I start envisioning fish in your arms and create it as artwork. I want to make art of you because you've inspired me so much. I want to make art of you. Those might be the most romantic words ever spoken. I want to make art of you. My wife is going to be so mad I said that about Slash. Oh my God, you guys have to You've got to love it. My piece of it is coming up. You did such a good job. Oh my, you did Thank such you a good job. Was, my God, that was so much fun. By the way, guys, go to, you have to check out the website, weissguylacy.com. You'll see all of Steve's art. It was amazing to see yeah. how you do every step of the process. You're not some diva showing up, pointing. No, You totally. are washing those uh, screens. I'm getting my hands dirty things. the whole time. But yeah. that's yeah. part of it, isn't it? Oh, it's the whole thing, totally. I, it's seeing it from start to finish is so satisfying to Like, us. pushing aside what you do on a mm. daily basis mm. where we see you all buttoned up yeah. and tied. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? And again, Getting in touch yeah. with that creative side and blah, 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 it's very therapeutic. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I was such a spaz until I saw myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like that. But it actually you know, it shows you why I need to do the art because I'm like this so much. You just gotta focus on getting the ink through the screen, and that slows me down. So that's the whole value of it. And you know what I love? They, go ahead. I was just saying you're so in control when you're on on as a news anchor. Uh -huh. So you need some sort of outlet. You know? Absolutely, yeah, yeah. no, for sure. What for Steve sure. said is, this is my version of golf. This is what I think about, right. this is what I focus on, it's my meditative quality, right? right? Mm, absolutely, no, it's, it's a zen pursuit, because it, it, it grounds out all the noise, and then you just have to focus on getting the screen to come out the way you want, which is very challenging. And you're but it's also, products. you're in complete control of everything, you know what absolutely, I mean? Absolutely, right. Which is probably which is, your nature you know anyway. Right? In, in news, there's oh. a lots of chefs in the kitchen, and this is just my thing. Right, right, right exactly. You know? Are you a perfectionist? Yeah, absolutely, yeah. So if you mess up on something, mm -hmm. would you start all over? Will you rip the, the great, screen the up great and say, about, no. The great thing about working on canvas is it's forgiving. 
there's nothing you do that can't be undone. Mm. That's what I like about mm -hmm. it. So, as opposed to paperwork, if you make a little mistake, you can Unlike the news. Unlike news, right? Unlike right. 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 Yeah. Do you like to do it alone? Or like, if someone comes knocking on the door, mm. Steve, let me you know your wife. You know. Well, I have to do it at the studio because it's such a messy process that you just got to go somewhere where you can make a complete mess and um, leave it all behind. So I'm there basically by myself, but there's other people that come in uh, the studio, and I like to talk about art with them, learn from them, we learn from each other. But in general, yes, it's you a very much... You put music on while you're doing some rock and roll? Oh, of course, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Guns and roses, <laughs> yeah. who you put it You on? know my drill by now, Laurie. You do. Um, but it's, very, it's, it's a solitary pursuit. Which is what I enjoy about it. Because we're only children. It's, gorgeous. Oh, yeah. well, it's all about the only children. That's right. We need our hobbies, bro. Yes, yeah, sir. Uh, are you going to have a show? Are you going to have, like. So, right now, we are up at Art Basel in Miami at the place that you saw in the piece yeah. at Walt Grace Vintage, which is really cool. So, okay. a lot of people are going to see my art, and that's very exciting. Anything here? Anything here? Same. We did a private show in New York. More to come on that. All right. All right. All right. Excited for yes, you. Yes, thank you very much, Lauren. Nice Great. I appreciate you being here. Beautiful. Thank you.